Alrighty. Blood makes the grass grow. That's the kill, kill, kill. That's the motto for aggression. And I am, I am so pumped for aggression. I, I, I think unsurprisingly, my favorite aspect is probably going to be protection with him. I think a perfect defense build is going to be really cool. So I'm excited to do that leadership. We'll see. We'll see, but let's do aggression. So our basic kit, and I think a lot of this does not change. We are going to cut unshakable. I didn't see a lot of status effects in. Was I stunned? Did I mess up that that last time? I don't remember. Anyways, um, I think I was. I think I, I think I was stunned last time and I I had to whatever. I'm going to cut unshakable. I think that makes it into like a generic Colossus deck, but we're going to go death focus. Absolutely. X jet. Yes. Utopia is a maybe I think invulnerability makes it in there. Limitless stamina. Yep. Those, uh, those make it in there. Yeah. Professor X makes it in there. Angel probably does. And then these as well. So that's two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve of the 25 cards that we get to pick. We'll see what Utopia brings. Okay. So we want to be, I feel like it's going to be so hard to not run Wolverine. <laughs> I feel like Wolverine is just such a good hero or an ally. Let's see. We got chase him down, bring it looking for trouble, skilled strike. Marked could be in no. And he gets plus two hit points. No. Aggressive energy. We could go crazy with the aggressive energies and see what happens. Surprise attacks are could be interesting for Colossus because he likes to flip so frequently. Surprise attacks could be something. Assault training could be ooh. Assault training could be cool because we do want to be flipping down frequently. Press the advantage. Energy sphere. No, toe to toe. Toe to toe could be interesting because we like the attack training. Attack training. I feel like I. I feel like I really want to do that. I'm gonna go attack training with Wolverine, and then go with the uh, danger room, because we are gonna be down. We're gonna be. We're gonna be asleep for a while. Team strike is really solid. Then combat training. To put us at four, and then those limitless stamina's are really solid. Let's let's pull it, let's pull out a combat training. Um. <laughs> Okay, so let's grab two copies of attack training. Let's grab Wolverine. That's two, four, six. Let's grab Are these sentinel I'm gonna keep sent I'm gonna keep the sentinel modular in here just because I think it works so well with the overall scenario. And I wanna play it one more time. But that's the targeted for elimination. There's more sentinels. I just feel like it fits very well. And so I'm gonna keep it in for at least one more game. Um Dust feels really good in a four player game but not that great now in a solo play magic from your hand spend a mental resource i don't love them we may go off we may go off x-men because we can definitely do that um we could go marvel boy marvel boy is an interesting piercing and range with all the toughness that this scenario throws at us so let's grab marvel boy for that two cost Uh, and we, oh, let's go bug. 
bug with a where is he with an attack training yeah yeah i'd like that i'd like to see that swinging for three and healing it's two four six eight where's my we want danger room that only works on x-men allies but still it is nice to have Mm. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Six more cards. Surprise attack could be pretty good. I feel like chase them down is actually a pretty solid option. Team strike is really good too. Um. Oh no! Training cards can only be attached to X Men allies. I think bug is still good to have, but that is that does very much limit us. Hmm. Well, that's too bad. Oh well. Team strike. Let's go team strike. Because team strike with Wolverine can that'd be five plus four. That's a lot. That's a lot. <laughs> that's nine. So that's a Two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. Gonna try and stay low costed. We could go magic. Yeah, those are not elite, so we could go magic. If anything, we can throw a training on her and she becomes a, a four attack. Let's grab her. Three more cards. Anything that I'm completely missing, y'all? A surprise attack for two. Nothing that gives us tough in red, right? That's mainly green. Dropkick is an interesting because once we have uh, organic or whatever the one is that can generate fist resources, dropkick could be very playable. <laughs> Let's run 2x dropkick. We need one more card, which we may actually cut. We can cut bug. If we cut bug, let's run the two. Just because I want to try him, the aggressive energies. That sounds kind of fun. Because we don't need chump blockers. Bug is just out there to be out there. So let's toss bug, put him away, and we'll run aggressive energies. Alrighty, let's see what red has to offer. Running same stuff. Dust may be worth it with all the minions in this set. She's expensive and she, she attacks for with the with the combat training she may be worth it hmm I'm trying to look at what I would cut I could cut a limitless stamina for it up marvel boy for dust but we then we lose our piercing 
but Wolverine has piercing so let's let's just try it let's see what happens I'm all I'm always up for trying new cards oops sorry about that she attacks each minion in play she gets plus one consequential for that attack Alrighty, let's try it. Let's see what happens. I'm always down. So, we got Colossus here. Uh, ooh, do we want to play Utopia? That sleeve's done. I think we do. I do. I think we do want to play Utopia because these are also the captives are X Men allies. So, hmm, we can cut a limitless stamina. I feel like that's a superpower, though, and that's just really good. Um, hmm. Limitless stamina in this this deck is so good though. You cut a magic. I don't know. I feel like we're running we're gonna we're gonna cut a limitless stamina for a utopia. Because I think it kind of does the same thing. It's accomplishing the same goal, which is readying. So we'll try it. We'll see what happens. So much about deck building is just refining and building on the fly and changing and tweaking after you do it, after you see what happens. So, all right. So Sentinel comes in with 16. We've got abduction protocols, mutants at the mall, and operation zero tolerance in play. We have got all of the cards out there. We will shuffle those up here in a sec and sentinel starts with toughness i agree with you brant if you're still here that this is a fun scenario i really like this scenario i really like colossus too I'm really enjoying colossus Okay, let's see what we got. These have been long games, y'all. These have been long, long games. We're three hours and 40 minutes in and we've done three games. It is new stuff, so that does take us a while, but these are long. Woo. Alrighty, so Peter starts with four or six cards. Titanium Muscles, Iron Will right off the bat. I love it. Got armor up, limitless stamina, limitless stamina, and invulnerability. I mean, like, we just may mulligan all three all four of these because we're going to be playing those and we're looking for there's a danger room attack training and team strike okay so I should not have mulligan armor up I'm just going to pretend like I didn't do that um Because armor up seems really good to stay in alter ego form this turn. So I think that's what we're going to do. We have a crisis and we have an acceleration. Okay. Okay. 
So we will toss an attack training and a Maid of Rage to play Iron Will. So we get plus one thwart. And after a tough status card is discarded from Colossus, draw one card. And then we will hang out. All right. So Villain's turn, we're going to place two here on the main. Sentinel is going to activate. I'm going to... Ooh, actually, we're going to draw it. So we got two, four, five, six. Oh, and I needed to grab an organic steel. I forgot the setup. So organic steel should have been in my hand. I remember that next time. Okay, so we will play uh, armor up. So we will flip into Colossus form. Sentinel will attack instead. So it's gonna be two. We have a tough status card, two plus two. So that runs into my tough. Iron will triggers, so we get to draw a card into attack training. So we've seen both of our attack trainings, which isn't super great. Um, okay, our just making sure I didn't miss anything. Yep, bad card is Sentinel Mark Three with toughness, and we go get an energy barrier. Uh oh, this is starting out a little bit quicker than last time. Okay. Hmm. Okay. So we'll toss a bulletproof protector and an attack training to play an organic steel. Which will come in with two. We're gonna to toss danger room and titanium or in combat training to play titanium muscles. So we get plus one attack. We're in a little bit of trouble here. Okay, so we got... That's gonna... We're gonna lose two cards if we flip down. So I don't think we can flip down which is a little unfortunate. Okay, so let's go ahead and just knock this. No, we'll thwart one off of here because he's just gonna get a tough status card back. Okay, so we will draw into drop kick, team strike, steel fist, steel fist. Not good, not good at all. Uh oh, okay, so this pops so we place this card under here sentinel is going to attack for two plus a boost which is zero that's nice and then sentinel mark three is going to attack for five i don't actually i don't know what to do about this i am not set up I can I can take him out with steel fist actually. Okay, so um, we'll just take the five down to seven. Bad card is energy barrier attached to a central minion without energy barrier. This card gains surge because we don't have one of those. Surges into gauntlet beam. Oh my gosh. Okay, well that's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt a lot. Um, oof. Okay. 
So we will swing for two to knock this tough off. We will toss a team strike and a steel fist to play a steel fist to deal five damage here to take this guy out. We're going to hang on to drop kick and we're going to flip down. Um, when we flip down, we will shuffle some stuff back in, which is going to be armor up. Oh, no, I almost shuffled everything back. In. <laughs> that would have been bad. Yeah, forgetting that organic steel at the very beginning is not good. So we're ready. Got one fist, two. Oh, there's an armor up. There's a there's my third fist. Shadow cat, so two, four. Magic. And a steel fist. Okay. So this goes two. Sentinel is going to scheme for two plus zero. Oh, it doesn't pop. Oh, that's nice. Um I have plus one thwart. This is down to this is down here. And then our bad card is going to be Sentinel Mark 5. When revealed, if targeted for elimination is attached to your identity, it attacks you. Otherwise, search the encounter deck and discard pile for target for elimination. While you are engaged with the Sentinel menu, you cannot change from hero form to alter ego form. Okay. There's a lot of bad things happening. <laughs> okay, so we're at seven. We're going to flip up to Colossus and get a tough status card. We are going to exhaust Titanium Muscles. Toss a Steel Fist and an Armor Up. No, a Drop Kick and an Armor Up to get rid of Gauntlet Beam. We will we'll toss Steel Fist, Magic, and Dropkick to play Shadow Cat. And Shadow Cat can ignore the Crisis icon. Do we kill the sentinel or do we I think we I think we lose another card that clears we get an ally we leave the sentinel out there so let's go ahead and thwart the abduction protocols when defeated we take one random captive ally so we'll reroll a five or a six a two okay we've got wolfsbane again that's good. That's good. So Will Spain's attack gains piercing. No longer have this guy. So we will swing and take out the Sentinel with Will Spain and Colossus. I knew you need those tokens. They are from buy the same token and I love them. I, I love all of the tokens. They even have like specialty ones, which I buy sometimes. So like Colossus, I'll probably get some when they put them out. But like here's like your your webbing or your uh, web shooter tokens for Spider-Man. But I have a I have a whole <laughs> I have a whole box of them. I love I love their stuff. Very very high quality. This is their my hero board is also part of their kit. So recommend that. It's it's very very nice. Okay, so we'll ready we'll ready we will ready. We'll draw four cards. The X Jet, there we go. We got Armor Up. Don't need that. We got Bulletproof Protector. Okay. And then we got Team Strike. 
Okay, so we lose this. So this is actually, we remove five. So this keeps one. So we're putting this card under, and this is two. Sentinel is going to attack me, which we will take to the face. So it's gonna be two, put Sentinel mark foe. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, Shadow Cat needs a damage. So that runs into the tough. We will use Organic Steel to add a tough, and then we will get to draw a card from Iron Will. There's Aggressive Energy. We got Sentinel Mark Four attacking us. We will defend because I really want that tough status card. Okay. We'll take an encounter card, which is a Sentinel Mark II. When revealed, if Operation Zero Tolerance is in play, it gains Surge. It is in play. Otherwise, self-repair. When revealed, discard each status card from the villain. Give the villain a tough status card and heal five damage from it. Okay. So, nothing happened. That was not a bad time to pull that. Okay. So, check this out. We are going to play Bulletproof Protector. So discard a tough status card from your hero. We are going to choose to add two tough status cards to our hero. We discarded a tough status card so we get to draw a card into Invulnerability. Alrighty. Um, that didn't work out as, as well as I thought, actually. You know what? No, we're not going to do that. We're going to have readied our hero. I didn't realize there was a cost to to exhaust your hero for team strike. Okay, that's fine. So actually, and before we do that, before we do that, we're going to, mm, it doesn't work out. It does not work out to do it before. Okay, so yeah, we'll do that. We'll discard this and we'll ready our hero. We are going to play aggressive energy and three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Actually, two, four, six. Okay. So before we do that, we're going to have Wolfsbane attack and knock this tough off and deal two damage to Sentinel. Okay. If you do buy them, buy them from their website, not from Etsy. So it's a little bit cheaper if you buy them directly from their website. Now we will play aggressive energy and a team strike. So we will exhaust Colossus and Shadow Cat and divvy up damage, X damage, where X is the number of attack or the attack of characters you exhausted. So this is three, four. Because we played it with an aggressive strike, it's five. Uh, so we're going to go four and then one damage here. And we're going to toss these three for an X jet. Oh, organic. Oh, actually, hold up. Forgot about organic steel. Yeah, we're going to use organic steel. So we do have a tough status card on Colossus now when we discarded it earlier. So I think my math would have worked out. And so we are going to hang on to bulletproof. Pro no bulletproof protectors out of my hand. So we'll have exhausted titanium muscles and toss these two for the X jet. This may be the last game for me. I'm getting pretty tired. I'm starting to miss a ton of stuff. So we may we may do a split game again. OK, so we'll ready everybody up. We'll draw. There's Professor X, Utopia, Dust, and Organic Steel. So we're going to place two here on the main. 
Sentinel is going to attack. We will take it. Um, so two plus two. Knocks off the tough. We get to draw a card. Sentinel is going to hit us for two. Our bad card is going to be Abduction Protocols. So that comes in with four. And Crisis. Okay. So. Let's... Let's go X-Jet and Utopia to play Organic Steel. I really wanted Professor X out there. Um, that comes in with two Steel Counters. There's that. No, we're not. We can't do that. I'll play that next turn, but we need to get Professor X out onto the table. So let's go the X Jet. We'll go Dust and Utopia to play Professor X. So Professor X pops out. He has a three thwart. So we'll go ahead and hit Abduction Protocols for three. No, we're going to hit the Maul for three. He takes one damage. We are confusing the minion or the, the villain when we do that. We will have We can't have Professor X chump block though, because then we lose to Operation Zero Tolerance. Ah, that's tough. Um We'll go ahead and have Colossus Thwart Mutants at the mall. Which gets us Jubilee. Um... Let's have Shadow Cat bypass the Crisis. We'll have Jubilee take a damage, kill the Sentinel. And then Wolf Spain will hit Sentinel for two. Which will kill Wolf Spain. Okay. So we will stand up. We're going to hang on to Organic Steel. We're going to draw into Wolverine. There he is. Aggressive Energy. And Made of Rage. We're going to play... We don't have this anymore. So we're going to place one here. Sentinel is going to attack. We're at seven. Yeah, so we'll just take it. Two. One, two. Oh, wait. Wrong one. One, two. And then... Sentinel is going to hit us for two. We've got one card. Warn the others. Force response after your turn ends. Oh, this is an obligation. After your turn ends, place this card face down under Operation Zero Tolerance. As an alter ego action, exhaust your identity and remove this card. So we will not be able to do that because we have to, we can't go to alter ego. 
Well, I guess we could. Oh, we could kill. Huh. Okay. Because this is when you're engaged with the Sentinel minion. So I guess I missed that. I missed that. Um. So that's on me. Because I should have flipped last turn. Because this is when you're engaged with the minion. These are some of those things that you probably that you just like run into when. It's your first play. So Professor X gets discarded. Mm, okay. We're gonna exhaust this to get rid of targeted elimination. We're going to have Shadow Cat bypass the Crisis to take two off of here. We'll exhaust Jubilee and toss the X-Jet to deal two damage to the Sentinel. Um, toss Aggressive Energy and Made of Rage to play Organic Steel. That comes in with two counters. We're going to flip down to Alter Ego form. So we're going to shuffle a Colossus card back in. Which is probably going to be... It could be Armor Up, actually. Because we will draw into Armor Up. But he's confused. So we're going to... We're actually going to go Organic Steel. Yeah, we'll go Organic Steel. So we're ready. Uh, when your turn ends, this goes under. So we lose on one more. No pressure. We got these cards. There's all my money. Can we pull it out? gonna be close Got one more card made of rage okay made of rage is good made of rage is really good okay so we're gonna place one here sentinel is confused two from the armor then we get two encounter cards because we just shuffled attached to the villain the villain gets plus eight hit points ouch Spend three lightning to discard that card. Then learning AI attached to the villain. He gains retaliate one. Spend three mental. Oof. Okay, well, that's not good. That's not good at all. Okay. So we're starting to get built, which is good. We can't get rid of the mental one, but we can get rid of the plus eight hit points, which I'm less, that's not as big of a deal. I think it's the retaliate that's gonna be a big deal for me, especially cause that's just gonna ping off my tough. So let's, we will flip up to Colossus. We get a tough status card. We are going to play a strength to put an organic steel onto the table. I think my death focus is under here, which is not where I want it to be. <laughs> okay, so strength, all right, that goes there. We're going to make a basic attack with Colossus with Made of Rage. So when you make a basic attack, discard a tough status card from your hero. You get plus six attack for that attack and the attack gains overkill. So we are attacking for nine against the Sentinel. We're discarding the tough. So it's gonna be two, seven rolls over to the main Sentinel. Because we discarded a tough status card, we will exhaust both of these organic steals, give ourselves two tough status cards, and then our Titanium or our Iron Will allows us to draw a card into armor up. Okay, we will exhaust Titanium Muscles for two.
costs an energy to play a Wolverine. So Wolverine's attacks gain piercing. And then we will toss an armor up for a studio, which is an alter ego action for us. We will exhaust Jubilee, exhaust the extra to deal two damage to the villain. And we're, we're not going to attack because he has that retaliate, which is just nasty. Okay, so we will ready everyone up. Draw four, seal fist, aggressive energy, team strike. Okay, that's, I like team, oh, and attack training. Let's go. Here we go, here we go. I like it. Um, We have to deal with threat at some point with our in our lives. So we're actually going to have shadow cat thwart two off of here. I forgot about that. No, th I'm sorry, thwart two off of here because she can bypass and then she dies. As we lose if that goes up okay so we place one here sentinel is going to attack we will take it so three total that runs into the tough we will exhaust organic steel to add a tough to sentinel and because we discarded a tough we get to draw a card into angel okay Our bad card is going to be Relentless Lower Rods. Each player engaged with a Sentinel minion cannot thwart this scheme. It comes in with three and it has a extra card every turn. Okay, so we are going to toss Aggressive Energy, Angel, and X-Jet to get rid of Learning AI. Get rid of that retaliate. Um, let's toss a team strike to play an attack training onto Wolverine. We'll exhaust the titanium muscles to play a steel fist. So deal five damage to an enemy. We're gonna hit sentinel. One, two, three, four, five. Discard tough to stun and confuse sentinel. Ew. Um we will we discarded a card, so we will draw a card with limitless stamina. Does not help us here. Physical. Um. Hmm. Wolverine could push Sentinel. Which wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. We get another abduction protocols at that point. I need to I need to figure out thwart. I need to I guess I'm ready. I'll take two here, and then we'll take two more here. To get rid of abduction protocols. We would get another abduction protocol once we push them. So we got one, two, three. Or right, one, two, three, four, five, six. We got five. So we got boom boom so two cost ally one one after boom boom attacks an enemy place one bomb counter added at the end of the player phase remove all bomb counters from play and deal two damage to each enemy for each uh bomb counter removed that way okay i like that that's fun um this is gone We're gonna have boom boom thwart one off of here then we will roll down when we roll down we are going to pick organic steel and shuffle it back in okay 
We've got a limitless stamina, which we will toss. We're not ready. Everything. We'll draw into a bulletproof protector, a steel fist. Bulletproof protector. Okay. Okay. Um, drop kick, so two, four, invulnerability, and a utopia. Okay. I'm I'm I like that. I like that. We'll place one here. Sentinel will be confused. And then Oh yeah, we have this relentless robots. Yeah. We got two cards. First one being Shadows of the Past. Okay, well, that's happening. Oh, this game is just not going my way, y'all. So we got Juggernaut. Juggernaut has Stalwart and Toughness. So 1-4. And then we've got Rampaging Juggernaut. Which has an Amplify icon. When revealed, discard each tough status card from each friendly character. Place two threat here for each tough status card. That's a bummer. Um... So that comes in with four. We have an Amplify too. Y'all, I don't know. I, I don't think we win this game. So an Amplify, we have a Hazard. Where'd my Hazard thing go? Yeah, this is not looking good for us. This is really not looking good for us. Then our next card is Homesick. We can flip to Alter Ego form. We can exhaust this to remove from the game. Discard this card and each tough status card from your identity. If you discarded no tough status card, this card gains Surge. Um, we'll exhaust our identity and remove this from the game. Shadows and the Obligation. You love to see it. You don't love to see it, by the way. Oof. Okay, um, my turn. We'll exhaust the studio to discard cards until we get, oh, we got an organic steel. Nice, I'll take it. Now we will flip up to hero farm, getting a, receiving a tough status card. We will play bulletproof protector to discard a tough status card and then give our hero two tough status cards. When we do that, we get to draw a card from Iron Will, which is a Steel Fist. We will exhaust Titanium Muscles. Yeah, we will exhaust Titanium Muscles. To play Organic Steel. Wolverine will swing at Juggernaut for four with piercing. So that goes away and he takes four damage. I don't want to push Sentinel right now because I don't want him to become stalwart or steady. I guess I do have a drop kick, so that could work. But I just, yeah, I just don't want to do that. We're going to play Bulletproof Protector to discard a tough status card to ready our hero. We will trigger Iron Will to draw a card, and then we will exhaust Organic Steel. This should have had been two to give ourselves a tough status card. I think we are going to push um, because I have a drop kick so we can he is steady not stalwart yeah so he's steady so we he will be stunned next turn regardless I just don't know what else to do with my hand <laughs> um, okay So let's go ahead and attack, discarding this tough status card for a Maid of Rage. 
So I am attacking for nine. Four goes here and five rolls over to Sentinel, which will kill Juggernaut and it will push Sentinel over the edge. Sentinel comes back in with 18. Okay. He has one stun card and he is tough. We search the encounter deck for abduction protocols. Uh, actually, he has 26. Because of the armor. Okay. This comes in with four. Two, four, five. I get to draw a card because I discarded a tough status card. So that's magic. That's not going to help us. Um, we also have a steel fist, so we could stun and confuse, but I think I'd rather do the drop kick. So let's go ahead and toss a steel fist, utopia, and invulnerability to play drop kick. Actually, first we're going to boom, boom, um, to knock off this tough status card. Then we're going to drop kick to deal four, place a second stun and draw a card. Into limitless stamina. That's kind of interesting. Um, down to 22. Bomb bomb gets a counter. We will, that last time I will have used this organic steel to add another tough status card to me. Then, we'll exhaust Jubilee, toss a magic to deal two damage to the villain. We will X jet for limitless stamina to stand up. I think at this point it's it's a race. We could go abduction protocol. We could take out we could take care of abduction protocol. Um in next turn. I think that's probably what we need to do. So we'll take two off of abduction protocol and we will at 20 we'll toss steel fist okay so we will ready 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 everything we got wolfsbane professor x danger room two three and aggressive energy start out by placing one stun gets removed we have two bad guards coming at us gang up so Sentinel is attacking for three plus a boost card. We'll take it to the face. Uh, if you, you are stunned, if you're already stunned, take two damage. That does not do good things. So tough, it's knocked off. We will exhaust organic steel to add a tough back. And iron will allows us to draw a card to combat training. And then we are stunned. Okay. Where did I put that second card? Did I put it back? Oh, no, it's behind here. And then advance, that loses us the game. Ah, it was a long fought battle. There's just so much threat to take care of. Oh my gosh, okay. Well, advance, he's gonna scheme for two uh, plus zero. That maxes out, so we have to put this under here and that loses us the game right there. Wow. Oh, bummer. Let's see, we would have had, I would have been able to get rid of adaptive armor with the X jet. So that would have taken them down to 12, uh, combat training. 
yeah i mean it'd be three this would have gone off so that'd be five six seven it, it, we would not have won it would have been a lot closer silent owl gotta go run some errands and do a, some adulting thank you for the great stream today thank you for hanging out i this is gonna be my last game i am i'm getting tired i'm missing stuff this is this is a long scenario this is a very long scenario which i try and pick a little bit shorter scenarios because i do want to try and get through all four so what we're gonna do is we're gonna pick back up at tomorrow at 10 a.m with colossus we'll continue running through sentinel um do two more of those and then we will depending on how long that takes because I, i'm pretty sure these two games took almost two and a half hours so that that is a little bit longer than what i normally like to be spending on 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 these types of games but it's a really cool scenario um but we will come in and um run a protection and a leadership build tomorrow morning so we will see you there tomorrow morning 10 a.m eastern same time uh good game thank you so very much b holland this actually I, I i'll need to go back but i can't remember i think the last time i lost a hero spotlight video was maybe valkyrie that doesn't that doesn't sound that doesn't sound exactly right it's been it's been a couple of videos since I've lost, so it, it's also like no, I lost I, the losing or the winning streak. It's gone. But thank you all for hanging out. I had an absolute blast. I love Colossus. I love the way he's playing. This is probably going to be in one of my top five favorite heroes because I am absolutely loving the combos. I think he is very very cool. I'm excited to take more look at him. Uh, play two more games. Hey, Strange Solutions. I think the threat mitigation really hurt aggression yes yes no and i still think aggression is really good with colossus it's just this right like this is this got this got out of hand quick this is crazy i i mean like i lost all the cards i i should have flipped down and i could have gotten it i think i think we pr yeah there's my death focus and they're a genius too but i think if i had flipped down i thought i could not flip down but when i had the minion when i did not have a minion if i had flipped down i think we i think i could have prolonged it one more turn we may have been able to figure something out um depending on what ally we got but ah very cool stuff very cool stuff i'm very much enjoying the x-men see you around see you tomorrow have a good saturday go play some marvel champions peace I'm